Hey everyone, it's your host, What the Most, right here once again. Now, have you seen the very first video of the day? If not, smash that bell, and of course, you will get a notification from YouTube. And don't worry, my viewers, I'll discuss my social media accounts after this part of the video is over. Switch gear, sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some to drink. Or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions on this subject in accordance to the link will be down below or the article will be down below. Now, this video will be strictly a link. Let's get into this show on the road. Now, everyone knows that Logan Paul re-signed with the WWE, not the long ago, okay? Or maybe he didn't. You know, I know there's a lot of people say, oh, that photo with him and Triple H was Photoshop. You tell me. But anyway, how do you feel if Logan Paul was part of Money Bank and actually he won it? How do you feel? Do you think that'd be a right move or a bad decision on Dovey's part? He's very talented in the square circle, but he's only a part timer. You know, what's the point of winning Mr. Money in the Bank briefcase if he's not a full timer? I don't like that. No. Don't give him that opportunity. And I guarantee the wrestlers who is there 365 days a year will be very, very pissed off at him and the WWE management. You never know. Maybe a lot of wrestlers will walk out because of this stupid stunt from WWE. Just because he's famous out of the wrestling world, that does not mean give this guy the opportunity. Hopefully that does not happen, okay? I'm not saying this. Sam Roberts, you know, you know who he is. He wants Logan Paul to win the Money Bank this year. Is he nuts? Just because he's very talented in a square circle does not mean he should win Money Bank of this year. He might participate, but no, he's not gonna win it. I'm sorry. I am sorry, um, Sam Roberts. No, hell no. That'd be a stupid decision. What was he thinking? Maybe just people want to talk about this subject. And I am I am going to talk about this. Could Logan Paul leave London, England as Mr. Money Bank later this year? I hopefully not. Because if he does... And if Roman's still the champion, that means he's going to cash in on Roman. And of course, probably Roman will defeat him like that. Like what happened with Austin Theories. Austin Theories was Mr. Money Bank for a while. And then he cashed it in, not just once, a few times. And of course, he, he failed. So it might be the same attempt right before the bell rings. So maybe that's why they want him be Mr. Money Bank winner. He's going to be that, but he's not going to win the championship. Especially, Rowan Reigns is still our champion. You know? You know, I don't mind Logan Paul is in the match, but please, for crying out loud, we don't let him win it because I guaranteed who's ever in this match will be very, very pissed off at him and upper management with Dewey. It's a stupid decision. Dumb. Hopefully it does not happen. Okay. Stupid. You guys could watch the video from Sam Roberts. Stupid. I don't agree with this at all. Just because he thinks he knows it all. Sam Roberts. You know. Just because he works for W. On the side. Does not mean he should have his own put. And hopefully does. W does not. Um, get advice from Sam Roberts. You know, if it happens, people will be very pissed off. So, if it happens, if he become Mr. Money a Bank winner, he is gonna completely fail, like John Cena did, and Damian Sandar. I forgot the name. All the guys who failed the the cash ins. Do you remember a long time ago, the Money a Bank cash in was always hundred percent, but then we change it because it was so easy to win it so you don't have to have it 100% that was very um 
predictable. Anyway, so what's your thoughts on this? On the article and the video down below, you guys can watch it. You agree with them? Disagree with them? Sam Roberts, now find me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. If you want to be part of the Robert Show, that's fine. Again, everyone out there, enjoy the rest of your Tuesday, and I'll be back tomorrow. Stay safe, everyone. Stay safe. Peace out.